guy I gotta do to get a drink in this place. I'm sure she'll be right back. You look a little dry yourself. Excuse me? A drink. Right. So you come here often? That's a line if I've ever heard one before. It's a question. It's also a pickup line. <laughs> I'm trying to pick you up, I would have already. Wow. <laughs> You're really confident. Confident in my ability to have a conversation. Well, usually conversations with strangers start with an introduction. Jimmy. Rachel. You're not from around here, are you? No. <laughs> uh, I just moved here, actually. Which probably answers your first question. <laughs> I'm not from here either. Indiana, initially. Seattle, regrettably. <laughs> Hoping to find something worthwhile in this place? Something. So what do you do? Who? <laughs> yeah, do you work? Um, uh, not much anymore. Active for a bit. And kind of got into racing cars. Like the Fast and the Furious? <laughs> the movie? <laughs> I've never seen it. That's probably for the best. <laughs> so like NASCAR, <clears throat> how safe is that? Well, people say racing is dangerous, but I take my chances on the track any day than on a highway. Because on the highway, you don't know what people are doing half the time. You don't know what this guy's going to do. What that one? On the track, there are a lot of men who spend a lot of time developing rules and ways of safety. Hmm. Never thought of it that way. Mm -hmm. So, have you won any of them? The races? One or two. <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't think that I would ever have the nerve to do something like that. Wait, you moved to a new place all by yourself. You must have some nerve. I figured it was time for something different. And that's so not like me. I'm all about Sam. I trust Sam. But if I didn't leave, then... You know, it'd be like going through life with one hand tied behind your back. I thought it'd be a nice change of pace to try and be a rebel for once. <laughs> Trust me, I've been. It's overrated. Ah. I feel so rude spending all this time talking about myself. Well, you have every right to be confident when it comes to stimulating conversation. What are you going to do? It's Hollywood. The sky's a little mid or something like that. Something like that. As long as you don't forget where the ground is. You sure I can't get you another? I've always been a one-and-done kind of girl. <laughs> well, at least let me drive you home. <sighs> as long as you promise to follow the speed limit. Give me a sec.
своему цвету. Excuse me. Another? Ah, uh, no, thank you. Did you happen to see where he went? Uh, the guy that I was sitting with, Jimmy. <laughs> Sweetie, you've been sitting here long since you got here. No, um, you you went into the kitchen and him and I were sitting here, and then I just got up to go to the bathroom and then. Look, I don't do a crazy to last call. I gave you one drink, right? What? Yeah, yes, no, I'm fine. I just the guy that was sitting here with me, he had brown hair, a black jacket. Um, he used to be an actor, he liked racing cars. Yeah, Jimmy, yeah, he was here. Back in 1955. You know I couldn't go with her, even if I wanted to. I need you. I need to get jealous, sweetheart. Do anything to please you, oh baby, please be mine. Boop. May I? Oh, yes, absolutely. I mean, um, <clears throat> sure, if I can use the company. Are you okay? There are so many answers to that question. I just, I know a broken heart when I see one. Norma, you know what I mean? I feel like I know you. Till your heart is mine to keep. Oh, baby, please be What are you doing here? Trying to find myself. Sometimes that's not easy. Is still alive. What is Jimmy? A dream. Have you ever been in a drag race? Are you kidding me? I just thought I'd ask. No gym race is in the tradition, you might say. Real racing cars, real tracks. How fast will your car go? Oh, an honest miles an hour. Clock, it's about 106, 7. You've won a few races, haven't you? Oh, one or two. Where? Well, I showed pretty good at Palm Springs. I ran a Bakersfield. Jimmy. We probably have a great many young people watching our show tonight, and for their benefit, I'd like your opinion about fast driving on the highway. Do you think it's a good idea? A good point. I, uh, I used to fly around quite a bit. Uh, I took a lot of unnecessary chances on the highways. And I started racing, and uh, 
Now I drive on the highways and I'm uh, extra cautious. Because you know, no one knows what they're doing half the time. You don't know what this guy's going to do with that one. On a track, there are a lot of men who spend a lot of time developing rules and uh, ways of safety. And uh, I find myself being very cautious on the highway. I don't have the urge to, to speed on the highway. People say racing is dangerous, but I'll take my chances on the track any day than on a highway.